Hey guys, welcome to the hamster channel and in today's video I'm going to show you how to move the windows from my old drive to my new SSD drive which is this. So SSD actually provided a software to download first so we can install it and by the way SSD means solid state drive okay. <laughs> So I'm going to start to download it first. So I already have the tab open and I'm going to click this uh, Qantas, um True Image WD Edition software. And I'm going to download it. When I'm finished downloading it, I'm going to show you, I'm going to turn the computer off and I'm going to show you how to install it. So now I'm going to show you how to install the SSD to the hard drive but first I'm going to tell you the basics first so here is the power supply and under the fan is the CPU and here right here is the memory and here over here is the video card and of course here is the my old drive so I'm gonna show you how to install it first it's really simple so of course here this is the power and this is the data so for the small little blue thing here plug thing this is for the power and this big one is for the data and when i'm finishing installing it and and you just reboot your computer and set up some things and you're done so now before launching the app you want to press window x on your keyboard and it should appear here and you're going to press disk management and here you're going to check so this is my old disk and yeah, this is my old one and this is my new disk. And you're gonna like replace it to the new one, move it to the new one. So I'm gonna close that. Now I'm gonna launch the app, the software that I downloaded. So press yes. So here you're gonna, pr you're gonna press clone disk. And here you just, yeah, automatically, next. So for the storage disk, you're gonna press disk two, and next. And in the destination disk, you're gonna press disk one, and press next. And it would say that on your new drive will, the data in your new drive will all be erased. So you're gonna press okay, then it will, start to clone your computer and reboot it so so guys i finished uh, cloning the drive and the drive we're using right now is the cloned one so we're gonna check so press windows x and press disk management again and look these two are the same so so it's cloned so that's it and i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification bell and like if you want to and make sure to follow the steps carefully you might get everything deleted or something i don't know but just follow it carefully bye